In the vast realm of garden invertebrates, there are certain creatures that steal the limelight due to their beauty, charm and unquestionable usefulness. Butterflies, bees, ladybirds are among the favoured inhabitants of our gardens and we gladly embrace their presence. However, amidst these celebrated creatures, there lies a group of slimy, tentacled beings often misunderstood and maligned, the snails and slugs. Today, we will delve into the world of these fascinating creatures, exploring their unique characteristics and the vital role they play in the ecosystem. As much as we hate them for the damage they do to our garden plants, we need to recognize snails and slugs are essential components of various ecosystems, serving crucial functions in nature, including the important act of pollination. To begin with, let's clarify the difference between slugs and snails. A slug often described as a snail without a shell. However, this is only partially true. Slugs are terrestrial gastropods closely related to snails. Slugs evolved from snails by reducing the size of the shell and internalizing it. They have evolved through such a process wherein the snail's shell has either reduced or disappeared entirely, adapting them to survive without an outer shell. On the other hand, snails are terrestrial gastropods with shells. These shells serve as a home and protective cover for vital internal organs. Snails are born with shells that grow as they mature, with the shells hardening due to the calcium they consume. The size of their shells can vary from something they can retract into for protection. Despite their slow movement, snails and slugs possess various senses that help them thrive in their environments. They have eyes on top of tentacles with the ability to see and sense their surroundings. Additionally, they rely heavily on their sense of smell and touch to navigate their surroundings and find food. Now let's see the beneficial aspects of slugs and snails. These seemingly unassuming creatures play vital roles in the ecosystem, benefiting both humans and other species. Surprisingly, slugs and snails serve as pollinators and spore dispersers. While not as efficient as bees and butterflies, these creatures can cross-pollinate flowers, helping with plant reproduction. Moreover, they play a crucial role in the reproduction of fern species, ingesting spores and dispersing them through their feces. In the broader environmental context, land snails and slugs contribute to the decomposition process in forests, aiding in soil nutrification through their decaying bodies, shells and feces. The shells, even after the death of the snails, continue to provide calcium for other animals in calcium-poor habitats. Another most significant contribution of slugs and snails are their role as food for other animals. Hedgehogs, some birds, snakes and frogs rely on slugs and snails as important components of their diets. By preying on them, these animals help regulate their populations and maintain a balanced ecosystem. Aquatic snails and slugs are also an important food source for many fishes, turtles and other species. They also provide shelter for other species. Beyond being a food source, slugs and snails are nature's clean-up crews and recyclers. Under the cover of darkness, they feed on garden debris, fungi and rotting vegetation, aiding in the decomposition process and nutrient recycling. They even consume the excrement and carcasses of other animals, further contributing to nutrient circulation in the soil. Land snails, being important environmental indicators, can help predict biodiversity and monitor climate change. Thus, their conservation should be a high priority. Aquatic snails and slugs, because of their sensitivity to certain chemicals, are excellent water quality indicators. While many people primarily associate snails and slugs with the common garden variety, the world boasts over 40,000 distinct species of snails, each with its unique characteristics and habitat. Snails can be found on dry land, ocean and freshwater, presenting an incredible diversity in size, colors and locations. India has nearly 1,450 snails and slugs with the highest diversity in northeastern India, followed by the Western Ghats. One of the largest snail in the world is the giant African snail. Conversely, the smallest snail, named Akmela nana, is a micro mollusk and can only be observed under a microscope. The diversity in size and habitat makes snails and slugs a fascinating group within the gastropods. So, it's quite clear that slugs and snails, despite their less popular reputation, are vital players in the ecosystem. 
They contribute significantly to nutrient recycling, act as pollinators and spore dispersers and provide shelter for other species and play a vital role in the food chain. And with that, our exploration of the slithering snails and slugs comes to an end. Until next time, keep your eyes open to the wonders of the natural world around you.